it's a brave man who takes on one of the most iconic dance scenes in movie history, but it takes a wild youth to carry it off. Dancing the jive, it's David Whelan and Salome Chachua. <laughs> So we're doing Pulp Fiction? Yeah. I love Pulp Fiction. And we're dancing jive. I'm ready to jive. Five and six. The jive has a lot of stuff going on. Very quick, very fast, but it's very cool. I'm really loving this one. I think this is kind of my buzz, and I'm trying to call into the gods of dance, make me John Travolta. Oh, that was very cool. This dance is full to the max. There's no way I can get through this without giving it more than 100%. We've been working really hard all week, and Salon is just after organizing a little surprise for me. I brought David here to help David get in character. Salon came in dressed like Emma Thurman. So she's in character, so I have to catch up with her. Obviously, everyone knows that John Travolta could dance, but his character in the movie is very plain faced. I just have to be like this the whole time. This is me in character, by the way. <laughs> Cheers. Here's a Sunday night. Dancing the Jive from the movie Pulp Fiction. David Whelan and Salome Chachua. It was a teenage wedding and the old folks wished them well. You could see that Pierre did the jewel of the mademoiselle. And now the young monsieur and madame are from the chapel bell. Said I be, say the old folks be close to show you never can tell. They furnished off our apartment with a two room rollback sale. The cooler I was crammed with TV dinners and ginger ale. But when we had found what the little money come and worked out well. Said I be, say the old folks be close to show you never can Stars there, I've said it. We're going to go to, I don't know how the dancing was, it wasn't looking at that. Um, we'll go to the experts for that. Arthur. David Mon Ami. <laughs> I can't even talk. This was the dance I want to see you dance. The jive. And I have something for you. I have a checklist here. Okay. Quick feet. Check. Characterization. I can't even talk. Well done. Check. Too cool for school. Check. And. It's so incredible to watch you both dance. Every week, you guys are incredible, 1,000%. And you keep blowing me away every week. That was drive perfection. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh um, there was a section about a third of the way through oh, where you did some. Not. No, and like he was doing the drunken sailors, and the right foot that crossed yeah. behind was a bit messy. Yeah. Oh, it was a bit messy. <laughs> but apart from that, I couldn't really find anything else wrong with it. To be quite honest, <laughs> it? And what I have to really compliment you on—it's week four. Most people struggle with week jive at any point in the competition. You almost learned two different jives because the first section really cool, really swingy. Then it went up tempo, and that didn't phase you at all. One word, blockbuster. Oh! <laughs> uh, well, Jen said it. It 
was just so cool down to facial expressions down to the hands I mean and then you gave us a full jive the kicks the flicks I mean it was very very stylish and that's what we're looking for now when we have Salome standing there with the leg in the air we all know she can stand on her own and that's the moment where you do need to shine mm -hmm. I wanted to see you do a little bit of more there and just getting that energy keeping it going from start to finish mm -hmm. but this was just fabulous what so a performance out, fabulous. <laughs> oh, we all need to cool down after that David Wild. Oh, cute. <laughs> yeah. How do you feel? I'm good. That was honestly better than I thought it was going to go. That okay. was an amazing experience. Blockbuster for yeah. Brian. I don't know what was on Arthur's checklist, but you ticked all the boxes. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was amazing. I just want to thank this lady right here. Honestly, every day she pushes me harder, and it's working, obviously. So I owe everything to her, her choreography, yeah. her dance skills. is infectious. Yeah. So thank you. The dancing aside for a second, it is movie week. Was there pressure to take on this character? Absolutely, he's the king. Yeah. Like, he's done so many dances in so many movies, and he has that coolness. That's like, he doesn't even try and he's cool. Yeah. So I, I don't look at myself as this cool guy, so I try my best to do as much as I could You did pretty as well, him. did you? Salome, does he take all of this in his stride? Yeah, absolutely. Basically, yeah. he loves challenges, so he took from John Travolta, and I think he did best. So thank you. Thank really you. Wow. Thank we got the thank you in. Thank you, David. The <laughs> scores are in. The judges have their scores. Brian Redmond. For the first time this year, from Brian, it's a nine. <laughs> Lorraine Barrett. A nine. Arthur Gurren I mean, it's a nine. That is the highest score of the season so far, a score of 27. If you'd like to see more of David and Salome, text David W to 53125, but not until all of our couples have danced and we open the voting lines. Make some noise for David and Salome. Still haven't cooled down to that.